Amravati, December 31st, claiming that people have started revolting against the ruling party in Andhra, former Chief Minister and TDP National President, Chandrababu Naidu, on Saturday predicted revolutionary changes in the state, continuing his tour of Nailor district as part of his ongoing program, Idemi Kama Mana Rashtraniki, he told media persons that 2022 remained a year of hatred, tragedies and destruction for Andhra Pradesh, slamming the YSR Congress Party, YSRCP, government. He alleged that every person in the state suffered physically, mentally and financially. The faulty policies of the state government pushed everyone into deep trouble and false cases have been foisted against those who questioned the government, Naidu observed. When the people in the whole state are suffering, the team headed by the chief minister, Jagan Mohan Reddy, is feeling happy, the TDP Supremo said, adding that innocent persons are being harassed by the Crime Investigation Department, CID. He also came down heavily on the government for borrowings and the sufferings of farmers. It is Andhra Pradesh which has the highest debt burden on the farmers and each farmer carries 2.42 lakh rupees debt. The state is in the third place in the country in farmers' suicides, Chandrababu said, observing that this chief minister hardly takes such issues into consideration. The TDP national president said that even ration rice supplied by the center is being diverted only for monetary benefit. The union minister stated this on the floor of parliament. He pointed out, expressing deep concern that ganja and other drugs are freely available in almost all parts of the state. He questioned the chief minister why he is not responding on such a serious issue. Atrocities on women are on the rise and in a district like Nailor alone 11 such incidents have been reported. He stated, youth are being pushed into depression due to growing unemployment and are resorting to suicides as they could not get jobs, Chandrababu said, adding that the less said the better about the condition of roads in the state. Maintaining that the YSRCP MLAs, who once faced financial problems have now become cropatis, he said and observed that they are looting the real estate sector. The situation is such that if one wants to dispose of one's own property, a share should be given to the local MLA, the TDP Supremo remarked. Narrating her problems to Chandrababu, a Dalit woman informed him that false cases have been registered against her and she is being subjected to harassment by the local police. The former chief minister made it clear that such police officers will have to face the consequences once the TDP is back in power. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to channel and click on bell for more daily videos.